Konnichiwa, this is the Shogunstein, and this is a look at sequence stacks. We'll show how to play, and we'll give you some of our initial thoughts. And just in the interest of disclosure, we got a review copy from Amazon Prime. So just in the interest of being transparent, we did get a copy of the game from Amazon Prime. So two of our favorite games, sort of mass market games, are Uno and Sequence. Two games we play a lot. I bring both of them to to game day, and even though they're mass market games, we still really don't get tired of Uno and Sequence. Sequence is a uh, kind of card-based game where you're putting down cards, trying to get a sequence of certain cards. Uno, of course, uh, the great card game. Two games have been around for a while, easy to get it at Target, even easier sometimes to get at the, the Goodwill store. So two games that we really enjoy. So we had the opportunity to review what looked like sort of a combination of Sequence and Uno, we were right on board, me and Little Shogunstein. So let's just show you how it plays. And it goes to six players. You can have two players. There are a couple special rules, some cards you're going to take out for two players. And it goes up to six. So that's always nice on a game day, game night, having a game that can handle a smaller player count. So what happens is uh, there'll be a stack of, of cards, and you can have... Uh, four sequences going. You can't have more than two of the same color at a time. And this element, the uh, the chips, this is from the sequence game. And what will happen is to win, you need five chips. That means you have to have five uh, sequences. You have to have at least two red, two blue, and then the uh, extra chip can be of uh, you know either color. But you have to have at least two red and two blue. The sequence will be cards one to five, and they go in the, you know, it's got to be order one, two, three, four, five. Now, there are some cards with a little bit of an uno element. You can block someone from getting a sequence. You can skip someone. You can steal a chip, which is pretty OP. And there's also one that uh, is a reverse that I had taken out of the deck because we had played uh, two players. So you're going to get a um, hand of five cards. The wild, again, this is a little bit of an element of both Uno. Uno, you know you have wilds. And in sequence, the game, you know there's the, the jack cards, you know, one-eye jack, two-eye jack, that can either uh, be any card or uh, remove a card. So a good combination of, you know, elements of both games. And what would happen is, so if this was my uh, hand... I could play this five. That would complete that sequence. That would go away, and I would get a blue chip. Now, you'll see here, um, I would also, um, there's a red one, but I don't have anything that I could put on that. I would need a red two or a wild, and I don't have that. you got to have the same color on the sequence bar. But I could play this blue one. I could play this blue two, and then I could use the wild as a three. This three, which I got nowhere to place, is going to go in a separate pile, and this is going to be a top card that I could use as a six card in my hand. So this pile is going to get more cards throughout the game, and the top card counts as like an extra card in your hand. So you always, at the end of your turn, have to put one here. Now, in this case, I don't have any cards left over after I put this card here, so I draw up to five. Two, three, four, five. If I had had two cards left over, then I would draw just three cards to make it up to five. You're always going to draw up to five. And the game will go on like that until someone has uh, two blue two red, and then uh, you get the uh, one extra uh, chip. You get that fifth sequence. Now, again, this game kind of combines two of our favorite games, Uno and Sequence. My initial thoughts are that it is neither as good as Uno or Sequence. And even Little Shogunstein, when I asked him, you know, would you rather play Uno, Sequence, or Sequence Stacks? He said Sequence and Uno. Also, 
the card quality, considering that this is a card game, the card quality is, is pretty bad. So I don't understand why games that um, are card-driven would use such poor quality cards. So initially, again, my initial thoughts here uh, that I am kind of disappointed in this game because it did take um, elements of two of my favorite games and uh, it's just not as good as either of them. And it didn't help that there's poor quality in the, the cards. So again, on the plus side, um, it goes, does play six, so it, it can be useful at a, at a game day. I would also suggest that make sure you do a really good job mixing the cards. If you have the cards mixed well, it'll make the game a little better. If you haven't mixed the cards well, the game is going to go by real fast. So if you are playing, thoroughly mix uh, the, the cards. So that's just some overall thoughts on sequence stacks. Again, we want to thank Amazon Vine for pro providing us a copy of the game for review purposes. This is the Shogunstein and Little Shogunstein out.